And we have breaking news to start our broadcast this morning. The Onondaga County Sheriff's Office responding to a deputy-involved shooting on the north side of Syracuse. A man has been left with life-threatening injuries. Deputies investigating two active scenes, the first on Carbon Street, the second between Lodi Street and Lemoyne Avenue. We're told they're in the early stages of the investigation, and Julia LeBlanc is live right now on Lodi Street with the latest. Good morning, Julia. Well, Dan, that second scene is not really very active anymore. Right now we're on the corner of Bear and Lodi Streets, and you can see there are no deputies left investigating the scene here, but they did just leave the scene after towing a vehicle from a driveway behind me. Now, this all coming after a deputy-involved shooting happening around 11 o'clock last night. That's when an on-duty sheriff's deputy was patrolling on the north side of Syracuse. That deputy then noticed a suspicious SUV on North Salina Street near Lemoyne Ave. The deputy calling for backup when the SUV turned onto Commonwealth Ave right near Washington Square. The suspects got out of the car and started firing shots at the detective's car. The detective shot back at the suspects, but they got back in the car and left the scene. We're told that deputy was not hit by any of those gunshots. So the now, right after that shooting, though, Syracuse police found that same SUV on Lodi Street and Lemoyne Ave. They found one unconscious male inside of the car with a gunshot wound. We're told that male is now at Upstate University Hospital with life-threatening injuries. And as far as the detective who was nearly shot at by the suspects, we're told they were transported to an area hospital to be looked at. Now, again, deputies are still looking for those other suspects. As far as we know, we have reached out for more information at this time. But as far as we know, those other suspects, and we're not exactly sure how many there are, are still on the loose. That one person, though, has been is in the hospital with severe injuries. If you have any information for the Onondaga County Sheriff's Office, you're asked to give them a call. That number is 315-435. 3081 or you can send an anonymous tip through tip 411 live on the north side of Syracuse Julia LeBlanc News Channel 9.